So, after that wonderful display of maturity, we can now leave. Hey! The crowd all cheered. Hey! I think I'm missing a couple of things. I'm not 100% sure what I'm missing, though. Uh, it's bothering me. I'm gonna have to look later, probably, I think, on a different character. I think I've missed something. Oh! Maybe it's because I'm not quite done. Maybe that's why I'm thinking I'm missing something. Look at this man! This man is angry! He has a hammer. Shows how angry he is. I punch him. And unfortunately, that does not stop him being angry. Other weapons may stop him being angry, but punching doesn't. Although punching is my favourite form of murder right now, so... Either way, we'll clear we'll clear the way of uh, these horrible dwarf men. As they poison themselves. They're basically the same as every other fat character. With a nasty weapon. Attack and get out of the way. Ugh. Slightly more annoying, the fact it doesn't... My weapon doesn't stun them at all, so it makes it a little bit more difficult than it needs to be. Okie dokie. I'm just going to pop an Estus flask. Sue me. <laughs> uh, two ways into the place we're going. One that way, two this way. Praise the sun. Praise the sun. Be wary of tough enemy. Yep. So this is the location of one of the covenants. I'll give you which guess one it is. It has praise the sun all over it. Fat man. He angry. Not sure what he's angry about, but, uh, you know. Maybe it's something to do with the fact that uh, he's all by himself down here. Don't worry, sir, I'll alleviate your pain by punching you in the dick. Oh, yeah. Dick punching commenced. Meow. Alrighty, so... I'm pretty sure there's something else around here as well. Hidden wall, something else? Ah, I forget. Either way, this is the Void of the Sunlight. Now, you can enter Covenant with them if you want, which I may as well do. Why not? Hooray! Sun Seal. Uh... We can learn a gesture, which is praise the sun, and we can offer sunlight medals, should we have them. Fun fact, this is exactly the same statue as the Dark Souls 1 version. And what does this ring do? I forget. Uh, let's see. Let's take off the life ring. Sun Seal. Ring of the Heirs of the Sun Covenant slightly increases miracle attack power, uh, which, well, makes no bloody difference to me. Anyway, we now part the Sunbro Covenant because, uh, well, why not, I suppose. Was it here? Beware of liar. No, it's not what I'm looking for. Oh well. Pointy being, we've got a boss to go and punch to death, so let's go on with it, shall we? Obviously, angry man is he's still incredibly angry, so we'll just let him have this angry moment. Oh, he's poisoned. Wow, I didn't realize these guys could actually get poisoned. We must just have high poison resist. What? We might miss one. Uh, let's move our way carefully through these scary looking parts. Um, there is something we want down there. Oh yes, wonderful squeaking. I forgot. Uh, so we will go down this safe way. Oh yeah, that is seriously a bottomless pit. It doesn't look like it, but it totally is. So, it's the last place you want to walk. In fact, I'm going to clear this poison because, you know... Actually, what am I saying? I can't be asked. Use one of these instead. Probably room full of squeakers. Yeah, got them squeakers. Oh, I'm getting bum rushed by squeakers. Oh, I'm getting poisoned by squeakers. It's a horrible idea. I may, uh, Estus Flask. There we go. Cut up squeakers. Oh, you know, I've always killed these things so fast, I've never actually seen them do anything. It's a bit. Ah! Bit of a shock. Move! Ooh. Doink. Hmm. Now, this is... Oh, I don't even have one. Uh, yeah. Did I pick up... What did I pick up? I can't really remember. Ring ahead. Yeah, this is where you get a nice ring, which, of course, if I had a Ferris Lockstone, I could show you, which I don't, so I can't. Uh, what did I pick up, however? Was this thing useful? Let's relook at the footage and see what I actually picked up. Ugh. Anyway. So, we want to go this way. Preferably out of the stinky water. Which we're gonna get poisoned in. Boo! Do I have another anti poison stuff? No, I'm just gonna have to hope I don't get poisoned out of that. It steadily goes up until it thinks you're completely. I did kill you, didn't I? I definitely killed you. Why are you here? No, no, sir, why are you here? I asked you a legitimate question, and you appear to be alive again. This is problematic for my liking. Oh, come on, I totally wasn't in there. What the? What? This is getting weird.
I'm very confused right now. Whatever, I guess I'll stay confused and um, carry on. Why did he come back to life? Maybe, maybe I did miss one. That must. That's the only reasonable explanation of this. There is a way onto that ledge there. However, it's really fiddly, and what end up happening is I'll probably bollocks. I'll probably end up dying, so I'm not going to do that. Cut up squeakers. You know what? It's time for sword and ball against these guys because these guys are just irritating without it. Oh, excellent three. Splat. I didn't realise there were so many of you. Are you all clones or are you just brothers? What else? Oop! Oh, this is going to take me forever. Do apologise. God, it's a smidgen more carefully than I would normally. I'm going to kill you first because you're ugly. Is that Dwarfist? I guess it is. Ooh. You gotta try and goad them into attacking, but at the same time they're they're so quick. Be really careful. Ordinarily, of course, you would also not pull three of them at once unless you're an idiot like I am. Ugh, swine. Dwarf, whatever. I drink Estus, chew bubblegum, but I'm all out of well, everything actually. Excuse me. Ah, lose it. Oh man, this is getting tedious. Finally, there we go. See, they do get staggered, bastards. Ah, he's stuck. Ah, I better deal with that. To be honest, I. Oh, it pains me to do this. Where are those witching urns? Oh, black. Oh, yeah, yeah. I like the sound of that. Enjoy. Wow, that was. Really, not anywhere near as much as I was hoping. Well, no point running down there, is there? I'm up here, mate. Yeah. Do you bloody right. You want to come out of that hovely or am I going to have to come down and stab you? Oh, that's really bad. Oh, that's really, really bad. I'm deeply upset about this outcome. Oh, okay, that's an improvement on my really bad situation. Okay, cool. Nah, I gotcha. Okie dokie. First things first, I'm going to be getting my humanity back so I stop looking like something that's been lifting the washing machine for like 20,000 years and get my durability back on my weapons. Once I've done that, we will continue with some jolly cooperation and get some people in. Oh yes. That's way too close to the door. I'm done. Unbelievably sadly, there's literally no one around to summon at the moment, which is kind of annoying. So uh, I kind of had to pop a thingy. Uh, humanity. Equivalent. What's the word? Ah, bollocks. Name. Name. Human Ephedri! Yeah, I just had to use a human effigy instead, so my durability is still shot and I still have no Estus. Um, well, on the plus side, hopefully we'll be able to summon some people in, unless something really weird is going on. Maybe something really weird is going on. Either way, hold on. Okay, so I got my two phantoms. I got Crocodile and Shinoa, so thank you very much for joining in on Twitter, guys. It's really helpful. Although, Shinoa, I didn't see your name down there. I just assume you're part of this, and if you're not, I apologise. Anyway, point being, let's rock and roll. Okay, this boss is unbelievably shit. He's like, he, even by like easy Dark Souls standards, that this guy just sucks. He's a bad boss. He doesn't do anything. He like kind of like leaps towards you, maybe if he feels like it. Like you kind of just go to him. He does stuff. He goes whoosh. He may roll. I'm not even gonna get a chance to do anything. So you need to go to his attack. All right, then he goes splat and does stuff. So just punch him on the side. Is he gonna roll? Is he gonna roll? Oh, he's gonna roll. Oh, ooh, deadly, deadly. It's really not deadly. Ah! Okay, deadly. Let's just stop mocking bosses. Gonna get me killed. So I'll pop one of my valuable life gems. <laughs> Cause I got the rest of the flask. Uh. Oh, is he rolling? No. It's actually easier when it's just you. Cause you can get to target you, and you don't. You can not get squashed by accident. That's literally all he does. He just walks around and flops his ass around. It kind of sucks. And that's it. He's dead. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Uh, yeah, that's the Coptus Dean. Thank you! Good stuff. Um, yeah, unbelievably bad boss. Like, seriously, from what the hell? Like, he doesn't do anything. He just kind of flops around like evil Jabba the Hutt. And with that, we can, well, move on, I guess. 
Hello, it's Luke Still on the road. Yes, actually. Sorry to have burdened you, sir. No, not at all. This is for you. By way of an apology. Oh, well, thank you. A ring still protects too, which is actually quite useful. I found my thoughts growing hazy. My memories are fading. Oldest first. The curse is doing its work upon me. I am frightened. Terribly so. Should do what I'm doing, just like eat souls like for breakfast. <laughs> nom, 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 nom. A really baller hat? It's a pretty cool hat, trust me. I had an older brother. We learned to fence together. We get to meet this older brother, by the way. It's quite cool. He became the most decorated swordsman in all of Mira. He was alright. I never even compared to him. But I never beat him. Not once. But then, one day, he was gone. Lost without a trace. Did you uh, check behind the sofa? That's why I always lose shit. But he was taken by the curse. <gasps> the curse! I think there's a movie called The Curse. Maybe being quite crap. If only someone would hear my tale. Well, you got about, I don't know, 2,000 people listening my right now. It's not bad. No. That's Luke Teal's little tale. So. Boom! Uh, that'll be it for today. We've basically gone through uh, Harvest Valley and we are going to be heading now to, well, the next bit. I'm actually going to try and get some summons in for the Covetous Demon. I can't believe there's literally no one down there. I call bullshit. So, um, that's what I'll be doing. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. And, uh, well, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Until next time.